I'm Bruce Lurch with the Boston Herald, and on a Saturday that boasted three matchups of top ten teams from the Herald's latest polls, we take you to Ed Burns Arena, where number six, Arlington Catholic, hosted seventh-ranked Austin Prep in a Catholic Central League Large Division showdown. The AC fans were in a festive mood, hoping to grab a key win in the league, as well as help longtime head coach Dan Shine celebrate his 60th birthday with the 500th victory of his career. The home team did not disappoint early as Ryan Tierney puts back the rebound of a shot from defenseman John Rogers to give AC a 1-0 lead with 4.55 left in the first period. On to the second now as AC's Andrew Somerville digs the puck out, dishes a pass to Ryan Smith, and puts it home for a 2-0 advantage. Austin Prep dug in hard for the third, starting the final frame off with a score as Ryan McDonough stays with the break-in and buries the rebound of J.J. Layton's shot just a minute and 24 seconds in. Austin Prep on the power play now as the puck finds its way to Bobo Carpenter at the point. The Boston University commit unleashes a bullet that beats AC goalie John Richard, ties the game up at 2-2. Austin's comeback bid was severely threatened when two players were whistled for penalties on the same play. But not only did the Cougars kill off the 5-on-3, they also killed off another penalty immediately afterwards to keep themselves alive. That special team work was soon rewarded. Andrew Cross fires an outlet pass to Mike Egan. Egan beats his man, then cuts across for the backhand finish with two minutes and 48 seconds left to play. That goal would hold up as the winner as Austin Prep rallied with three goals in the third period and spoils the party with a 3-2 victory over Arlington Catholic. For the Boston Herald's High School Sports Department, I'm Bruce Lurch.